I'm 25 years old. He said, "This is America, land of opportunity. Why don't you set a goal to become a millionaire?" And then he said, "For what it will make of you to achieve it." And I thought, "Wow, that's a whole different philosophy. Set a goal to become a millionaire for what? For the person you have to become in order to be worth a、uh, million dollars." Then he said, "Once you've become a millionaire, you can give the money away." Because what's important is not what you got, but the person you became.、Mm. And I got the message.、Mm. And that's where I started hearing those phrases from him: "Work harder on yourself than you do on your job."、Um, bringing value to the marketplace is how you get paid. The more value you bring to the marketplace, the better your pay, and also you get paid for what you become:、mm. a leader, an entrepreneur, a manager, somebody who. Has the ability to inspire other people. So、uh, somebody's watching and they're saying, "Okay, work harder on yourself than you do on your job," and they, 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 they agree with it in principle. They say, "Yeah, that sounds right. I know I need to work on myself." What, did, what would you recommend people do? I started out with developing a list of skills I didn't have.、Huh. You know, I'm raised in farm country, southwest Idaho. Right. I, I know how to milk cows, but the pay's not good. <laughs> That's right. So the first thing, and I started part time,、um, a little. Sales adventure on how to get customers. It was in health and nutrition, and、uh, I believed in the product. And I was taught, here's how you get a customer, and then here's how you ask them, who do they know that wants to be healthier.、Um, then、um, expand your business from there. So that was the first extra skill I learned from just the regular farm skills that started to change my life. So this is part of the personal development, learning that extra skill. In my seminars, I now teach. In the 21st century, you need more than one skill. One is for economic safety. Right. Here's the guys that the, that's worked for General Motors. They just what closed a couple of plants and laid off what I don't know 25,000 people. This guy has been there, let's say, for 15 years. Now he's laid off, and he tells us he's already having economic difficulty.、Mm-hmm. And the reason is, Chris, he only had one skill. You know, over the last three or four years, if he would have taken accounting two nights a week, or something, yeah, so that when this crisis occurred, he would have something to fall back on.、Hmm. So in my seminars, I teach a whole list of skills I learned、uh, by the time I was thirty,、uh, thirty-one, that not only made me rich, but、uh, really broadened the whole scope of my. Ability to be an entrepreneur affect other people's lives, and then I got into, of course, teaching and training. But、uh, that's part of it. I learned sales. I learned to find good people. I learned、uh, to get people to work together. Interesting phrase in the Bible says, "If two or three agree on a common purpose, nothing's impossible." I thought, "Wow, two or three, not all alone, but two or three." So if you can. Get inspired and inspire a couple of people to go with you. You could do some pretty extraordinary things. I learned how to do that.、Mm. Then I learned、uh, recognition and reward, rewarding people for steps of progress. You may work for a company and they reward people for the big steps. I've learned to reward people for little small steps of progress. Anything you can think of、mm. to give them a, a reward for making、uh, some progress. It doesn't have to be a big reward.、It、doesn't have to be big. Small. something small. Kind word. Then it、uh, comes to a philosophy that says, "Be so busy giving other people recognition, you really don't need it for yourself."、Mm-hmm. Now you've arrived in a very good place. Your greatest happiness is other people getting rewards, not necessarily yourself.、Mm-hmm. But then Zig comes back with the old philosophy that's so true:、mm-hmm. if you help enough people get what they want, from either money to recognition or Success,、uh, you can have everything you want. Yeah, I heard Zig say that I think almost 50 years ago, 45 plus, and、uh, when he said you can have everything you want, I underlined the word everything because <laughs> you could want a lot. And、right? I said, hey, I think Zig is right. If you help enough people get what they want, yeah. But that's another skill.、Mm-hmm. Then I think the ultimate skill is the skill of communication. And I divided that one into three parts. One is training, right? Showing somebody how to do the job. Next is teaching, and I simply use the two words for、uh, a 
purpose teaching life skills. Because one of the things that helped me really revolutionize my life, age 25, was learning how to set goals. Decide what you want, write it down, start checking them off. Where do you want to go? Make that list. What do you want for your family? Make that list. I started doing all that. That's called teaching, teaching life skills. So if you combine job skills with life skills, your chances now really start to multiply. Then the ultimate in communication is learning to inspire, helping somebody to see themselves better than they are,、um, transporting them into the future. Say, Mary, here's who you could become. With just a few changes, I promise you, you'll never be the same again. Here's the kind of person you could become: confident, strong, able to cope with circumstances, changes. You could be that person. Thank、you